What's up? This is the orange batch. Um, the wine that I'm making. It's uh, sweet. But it's definitely got that alcohol smell. Um, or wine smell, I guess, if you've ever smelled wine. Um, it's definitely got that. I would say it's more like alcohol smell. Um, I've drank in all of it. Well, this is my last. Well, not cup, but mason jar. Whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah. Two days. And... After this, I'll be fucked up. Um, so, two days, imagine seven days, or a month, or a year. Like, yeah. Uh, I would say this is, like, already uh, half a water bottle. I don't know what we call that. Like, it, it, it's, so, traditionally, wine after seven days would be 5% alcohol content. Uh, half a, half of one liter shouldn't be 5%, um, considering that this would be, what, three quarters of half uh, one liter um, so if you if you think about it that's not five percent that's more like I don't know ten I'd say ten percent alcohol content uh, considering that I'm pretty buzzed right now um, there goes my you're at fifteen percent um, Mind you that most people would say that what I'm making, if you look at my other videos, is called Prono Juice, or in other words, Prison Juice, uh, Prison Hooch, um, which would be correct, I, I would agree, um, you see all my shit, um, that one is... Jameson, that'd be Black Barrel, my favorite. Uh, the one next to it, that's the regular Jameson. Um, and then you got Captain Morgan, and then you got Crown, Guinness, and Crown. Yeah, my favorites. Um, back to my drink, though. What was that saying? I don't know. It's, it's very sweet right now. Um, that's because it's it's only two days of, two days fermenting, you know. So all that sugar and stuff is still there. So yeah, it's gonna be sweet. Um, Goddamn that alcohol! Like you can taste it. Um, yeah, no, I'm very happy with this. I'm about to make another one, but uh, the next one, I'm gonna wait a month. Uh, my blueberry raspberry, I'm gonna just let it ferment, um, just because it's running off of a little bit of extra yeast, but not that much. Um, but most of it will be just natural yeast, so I'm... I figure this had a whole packet of yeast. That doesn't. That only adds has what? Uh, it's like a teaspoon, I believe, is what I put. It's a teaspoon of yeast, and then a teaspoon of extra sugar, just to uh, so that I don't kill the original yeast that is there. Cause I, I was kind of worried. 
because uh, I my assumption was that it takes at least 48 hours for uh, the natural yeast to start fermenting uh, the sugar because uh, that's what it is um, it, it's the yeast breaking down the sugars that's pretty much all it is like moonshine you take water yeast uh, preferably you know alcohol yeast is what you would do and sugar and then you have a uh, specific word for it uh, I've gotten a buzz right now so I don't know um, it's basically um, whatever you want to call it I don't, I don't know a still you, you, you know um, that's how you make moonshine uh, white lightning is it's basically water yeast and sugar uh, what makes it moonshine uh, legit moonshine is the steel um, that's how you that's the proper way to ferment it uh, it's not like prison chrono you know uh, you can't just put it in a bag stick it underneath your mattress and hey you're making alcohol it's not like that uh, but basically if you want to make moonshine you, you take water water sugar and yeast and that's how you would work that um, that that's just the first basics uh, and then you grab a stick uh, fucking whatever I know I, I said it but now it's space in my mind um, but yeah I'm very happy with this uh, I'm gonna be extremely happy with my next batch and my blueberry raspberry it's doing fucking awesome it's fermenting um, the way you can tell is by those bubbles uh, basically it looks like it's carbonated you know uh, like a carbonated drink that's what it should look like it's little fucking bubbles that are rising. Um, that's basically what it is. Um, yeah, uh, if you have a lot of acid reflux like me, um, have some ginger next to you because I've already had a acid reflux. Um, yeah. So, yeah, um, Cheers. Very sweet, but very alcoholy. I like it. Uh, anybody who says Chrono Juice is fucking disgusting, you're stupid. That's what I gotta say. You're fucking stupid. Uh, another thing is watching these YouTube videos and looking shit up online. Some of it's kind of not legit. Um, they don't actually know what the fuck they're talking about. Uh, and that's just, you know, my experience from making five fucking batches. Um, like, f for me, I'm making this because I want to get fucked up. Uh, without paying $50 a bottle. This is what? Five bucks, uh, for... A bag of oranges. Uh, the only most expensive thing you gotta worry about is your water bill, and depending on how much you're making, uh, is your water bill and yeast. Yeast is kind of expensive depending on what how you do it. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, like the way I'm doing it, it's it's kind of expensive. So be mindful of that. Um, one thing that I will say, what the internet taught me is, sugar equals more, more sugar equals more alcohol content. That is legit, because I put a t ton of fucking sugar in one packet of, um, Flitchman's yeast. Yeah, two days. This is getting me fucked up. I'd say this is about 10% alcohol. 
so. Yeah. Um, that was a little update. Uh, oh, uh, my blueberry. You see this? This is where the blueberry raspberry was. That's because uh, the fruit and the foam started rising up to the top super fast and that will cause it to explode. So I just ended up putting, oh, God damn it, uh, putting it in a bag. So I suggest if you're gonna make Brono juice, put it in a bag, uh, take a rubber band or a, some elastic and wrap the top because it's gonna have a little hole regardless there as long as you don't twist it or anything it's gonna have a little hole at the top so the gas can escape and then well you just put it somewhere you know 75 or 65 to 75 degrees uh, preferably your basement your bathroom um, don't have uh, UV light on it god damn it um, it's, my phone's warning me about my battery. Don't have UV light on it, because that'll kill, like, the yeast, apparently. Um, or you stick it underneath your mattress. Stick it underneath your mattress. Basically what you do. Um, so, yeah. That's basically it. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like it, like it. If you want to subscribe, I, I see that uh, saw that other subscriber. I got five subscribers on this video or this channel now. That's what's up. Thank you for subscribing, whoever you were. Um, if you go on my other channel and watch my gameplays, it's capital A, capital S, A smile. Uh, go watch my gameplays. Subscribe. Show me some support. Like, dislike, doesn't matter to me. Uh, hit that bell notification when I go live and you can join me. Um, yeah, I'll see you on the next video.